Hello, my lovelies. Today we are going to talk about unlocking hormonal health, a link between hormonal problems and your health. And the reason why you're not seeing me is because my camera is not working. No idea why, but it serves everyone because I'm in pajamas. So I'm going to be completely honest with you. But since you're here, let's just dive in because the topic is important and I want you to learn something today. So today um, we are uh, covering important topic because many of you might think and feel that the hormones are in charge of your life and literally it is true we women are basically slaves to our hormones from everything from the productivity to everything everything is ruled by our hormones so what are the roles of hormones in your body what is what does hormones do so the hormones are uh, responsible for the mood regulation, for your energy level, for weight management, for your bloating, for skin problems and fertility as well. Uh, the hormones are the chemical messengers that regulate various body functions. And about this in the second. So let's talk more about which hormones affect what so we have estrogen and progesterone they affect the menstrual cycles your fertility and the mood um if there's imbalance in between them in your period will be late uh, if there's imbalance in those hormones uh, it will be more difficult for you to get pregnant and if it's, there is imbalance between them, uh, your mood, mood will be affected and your productivity will be affected too. Then we've got insulin, which is responsible for the blood sugar and your energy. And we've got cortisol and thyroid. Cortisol is the stress hormone that impacts metabolism. And thyroid controls metabolism and energy levels that's why i put them all together because they are connected so the next part is the common hormonal imbalances which is our endometriosis pcos polycystic ovary syndrome thyroid uh, disorders hyperthyroidism and stress and cortisol which chronic stress basically so these are the most uh, common hormonal imbalances in our society and between us girls. Effects of homor hormonal problems on your health. So in uh, physical health, you can um, see that you've got the problems uh, with the hormones by weight loss or gain it's going to be more difficult for you to lose weight or gain weight you will feel, feel fatigue you will have a, a lot of digestive issues um hormonal fluxation can also affect your gut so uh, you're gonna feel bloated as well then we've got the mental health which is the mood swings you've got some cognitive functions um, which can impact the memory and the focus and i put the third one perception of you your hormonal problem affect your perception of you and how is that you might ask well because you see all of those physical um small things like for example you see that you have a problems of losing weight and you think oh my god i'm so fat then you see that you've got the problems with fatigue or um bloating and you think oh my god i'm so fat i'm so lazy uh, you've got you notice that you've got a problem with remembering things or the focusing and you might think oh my god i am so sluggish i i can't remember things i'm so lazy so you see all of these small things that are nothing else by indicator that you've got hormonal problems and you thinking this is you girl you need to stop this this is not you this is not you those small things can be fixed 
And if you are here long enough, you know that I go above and beyond to help you to fix them. So I want you to separate things that are happening to you from you, the real you, the perception of you. That's why I put the perception of you separately because I think it just messed up with our heads sometimes. Uh, it did with me. Managing hormonal health, it can come only through the lifestyle changes, my lovely, the permanent lifestyle changes, which is the diet and the diet, anti-inflammatory diet, exercise. Yes, it helps with your hormonal um, health as well. Stress management and supplements, especially omega-3 and vitamin D. Uh, which I am taking daily because I am blessed to live in the uh, country of doom, which is the UK, where there is no sun, pretty much. So <laughs> uh, tell me, please, what is your experience with hormonal health so far? Did you find something interesting from this video? Please like and share it. And... Let's just come together and help each other because Big Pharma don't care and the rest are here to make money, which is not me because I'm making a lot of money in Forex trading. <laughs> Spoiler alert. Thank you so much for watching and I'm going to see you in another fascinating video. Love you. Bye.